Hey, all of you. I'm not even gonna try that again. But hey, all you viewers, to play later. How we doing today? You got me all tongue tied this morning because man, we got something really, really cool that I can't wait to get put together. Not like I don't have enough. Terminators! That's right. We're going to take a look at Warhammer 40k, the brand new Space Marines Terminator Squad. Now, if you got all the intro boxes like I did from everything else up, you got a crap load of Terminators. Okay? I've got more than I can realistically field on the board at any one given point. I got this box set because of the additional weapons that are in there. But we're going to talk about all that right after we get the adulting out of the way. You know how we do it, so here we go. What up, you amazing people? Hope you're doing well today. Chris has asked me to do a quick elevator spill just for you. Now, here at Copper John's, I'm always preaching, be proud of who you are, no matter what. What this means to me is simply that you're gonna go out there to the world and present yourself in a way that you are proud of. So my job is to create something that allows you to do that. So here at Copper John's, I have 13 different scents, all in beard oil, beard butter, beard balm, mustache wax, spray clone, and a few of the solid clones. But we also have some amazing cold press soaps, beard shampoos, whether conditioning or stripping, beard conditioner, and some crazy cool combs. I am truly grateful for every one of you guys. If you ever need anything, please don't hesitate to hit me up. I'm here. Have a great day, guys. Take care. Great company. Great man. Deserves your support. Click that link down below. You ain't going to be disappointed. <clears throat> okay. I'm filming this video on Wednesday, November 15th, 2023. I found it at my local gaming store, Docking Bay 93. If you're in Skagit Valley, Washington, come check them out. Well worth your time. I paid 65 there. I've seen it all over the place from 50 to 70 So I'm going to leave a link down below to the cheapest price I can find. Always check your local gaming store first. Okay? So like I said, brand new Termi Squad. People have been clamoring because forever and a day, with the plastics, all you got is the assault cannon. Which to me is kind of cool, but I, I want that little whirlwind launcher on the top. And I want the heavy flamer. Because it's an option. And if it's an option, I want it. You never know when I'm going to field it, right? But like I said, with everything else, oh my god, I just put together a bunch of Terminators over the weekend. I'm kind of sick of Termies, but I need them for the parts. So let's break into this guy, and let's take a look at the sprues, because I just undid the shrink wrap a little bit ago. So I can take a look and make sure everything's in there before I film the video and go, <laughs> Okay, so if you're unfamiliar with Warhammer, I guess we have to call him now. Well, number one, welcome to my channel. Number two, everything they give you comes on sprues, and I'm going to show all that here in just a moment. I just need to get to the other parts out of the way. All right. They give you five movement trays for the termies. And a real small one for the teleport homer. Now, if you ended up picking up the box sets, you've already got your teleport homer, you've already got everything put together, so you're good to go. They give you a big old transfer sheet. Of course, they have the poster boys, the ultramarines on there. But they also have the imperial fists, the salamanders, and the raptors. So that's going to go in the giveaway pile of transfer sheets that I have that I have yet to figure out what I'm going to do with. Okay. Like I said, everything comes on spruce. We're going to show you that in just a moment. You do get an instruction book to tell you how to put everything together. And on the back is basically your index card. No big deal, right? I cannot stress this enough. When you're putting them together, make sure you're following the right color code. Because certain parts only really look good on certain things. And you want to build the right area that you need. You get three sprues in there to put together five terminators. And I get it. Some of these weapons are really, really big and whatnot. What I do love is they give you the options now for chain fists. So you can have a power fist or a chain fist, which I think is really cool, which is another reason I wanted this box set, so I can mix and match in some stuff for close quarters assault. <clears throat> I really don't think I'm going to need to build another sergeant because, well, <laughs> I've got plenty. I've got two. I think I can field two 10-man squads right now, so I think I'm good. Not that I'm ever going to field that many in one sitting, but still. So like I said, just follow along, you're going to be fine, okay? Just follow the instructions, I can't stress that enough, follow the instructions, you're good to go. Okay. Here's sprues for like the basic boys, no big deal. They're not push fit, I'm already happy. I'm seriously already happy. I'm so tired of push fit, it's not even funny. 
Yes, I have an irrational hatred of push fit. I get the concept behind it. I'm just sick of it. I really am. A lot of times things don't match up. Things look wonky, and you got to do a lot, of, a lot of work to it. When it just should be clip and push. That's just my opinion. But there we go. Another sprue of the basic parts that you're going to need. And here's the one we're all waiting on. Let's see. Let me make sure I got it right. There's the heavier weapons. There's your assault cannon. There's part to your heavy flamer. There's your other part to your heavy flamer. And where'd you guys go? There's parts to like your world, you know, your world one missile launcher. No big deal. And I like the fact that the teleport homer is one piece. I've already got one out, one painted. I'm not even sure I'm going to need that because how many times are you going to land two Terminator squads on a battlefield? I'm just, I'm just saying. I get the fact that it's a token. It's a great little marker. You can use it as an objective marker if you need to. I get it. It's kind of cool. I like these things because they're plastic. The versatility on there, the fact that the purity seals on there are a lot longer and a lot bigger, like I think they should be for the Terminators, because these are the most venerable, most veteran, most respected, most badass people in your chapter. These are the guys who have heavy armor. And on the Crux Terminatus, which is that little thing right there, the stone symbol on their shoulder pad, supposedly encased inside that is a piece of the Emperor's armor, which makes me go if Big E ever wakes up and steps off that frickin' throne, he gonna be pissed that his armor was divided up. That's all I'm gonna say. Then the other thing I've always wondered, if a Terminator dies, how much effort do they go to get that back? Because, like, the Drukhari can do weird things with DNA, and if it's a piece of the Emperor, you know, it just, it brings up a lot of weird stuff. Do I think it's worth your money for this kit? Yes. You get five badass fucking space marines with great weapon options because they always go, hey, out of every five marines you have, you can take this option. So if you have a 10-man, you know, Terminator squad, you have two heavy options. Two assault cannons, a heavy flamer, the missile launcher. I mean, the possibilities are endless, especially if you've got other kits. Yeah, this is a buy once, cry once kind of thing. Terminators pack a punch. They really do. The heavy armor, the multiple wounds, the everything else. And the fact that, like, if you play Space Wolves like I do, they can be Wolfguard Terminators. So they can be around your Warlord. So you've got your normal Termies and you've got your Wolfguard guys, which are even more badass than your normal Terminators. Just things to think about. Okay. Now, with all that fun stuff being said, I know we do unboxings a little weird here on this channel, okay? Matter of fact, we do everything weird here on this channel, and that's what I really, truly like. It kind of sets things apart just a little bit. Sorry, I'm going to get this boxed up so I don't lose anything and end up screaming and crying like a little girl. Kind of like I did with the Canis Rex thing a little bit ago, when I was like, oh my god, how did I lose this instruction thing? And I really didn't lose it. It was sitting in my damn chair. <laughs> Seriously, it fell out and was sitting in my chair. When I got up and started looking, I'm like, oh man... But, like I said, right the best part of the video. Now, if I made you laugh, I want to know your... See, I'm getting all tongue-tied this morning. I need caffeine. I really hate block filming because I lose my mind after, like, your 10th video. But still, <laughs> we're at the best part of the video. I want to know your questions, comments, love, hatred, anger. All that fun stuff right down below. Do you do 40K? If so, and you do Marines, what chapter do you do? Have you made your own? Because I see that's getting really popular again. And the fact that new things like the Raptors are really coming out with more in-depth detail. Like if my White Dwarf ever freaking arrives. Maybe I'll get to read it instead of having to go to the local gaming store and buy another one. Then have mine show up three weeks later. Which is a whole other video that I'm going to do in a moment. Like you said... How do you feel about Terminators? Do you feel the big force of them? Do you have a big, heavy chunk of them? Because they're like the tip of the spear. They're the guys you want to slap right into your enemy as soon as possible. Now, with that fun stuff being said, if it made you laugh, made you cringe, made you cry, I made you do any of that during filming this video, and I'm pretty sure that I did, please hit that big old thumbs up. It's only going to show love and support for the channel, give you some natural karma, and help you roll those sixes. Karma is a great thing. Put out good energy into the universe and get good energy back, right? But there we go, guys. My quick unboxing look, as weird as it was, at the new Warhammer 40K Space Brain Terminator Squad. I hope you guys are having a great day today. A safe day today. And one day, I look forward to meeting all of you across the tabletop.